Hello students, in this video we are going to study simulate and synthesis of code converters using all modeling methods. Code converters A code converter is a logic circuit whose big patterns representing numbers or characters in one code and whose outputs are the corresponding representations in another code. Code converters are usually multiple output circuits. Binary to gray converter circuit diagram given below B1, B2, B3, B4 are the inputs, G1, G2, G3, G4 are the outputs. Conversion table for the binary to gray conversion. Here we are converting the inputs from 0 to 15. Coming to procedure, double click on project navigator, close any projects open, go to file menu, close project, click on new project. Type the name as binary to gray and click on next, next and finish. Right click on project name, click on new source, very long module, file name is binary to gray and click on next next and finish type the code here here I have written the code for binary to gray in behavioral model ok and I have used case statements save the code and click on implementation synthesize xst double click on synthesize xst then double click on check syntax and see the RTL schematic okay. and technology schematic LUTs and input buffers and output buffers and view the design summary reports and synthesis report here three LUTs and eight input buffers timing is 13 seconds for synthesis and close the synthesis report and coming to for simulation we have to write test bench for test bench right click on project name and new source and click on very large text fixture and type the name as 
to binary to gray underscore tb click on next next and finish and add the stimulus here here I have written the input binary codes here from 0 to 15 and in time interval is 10 nanoseconds ok save the code and click on simulation and click on binary to gray underscore tb and double click on simulate behavioral model click on default WCFG and zoom to full view here the binary inputs are 0, 0, 0, 0, 0 2 1 1 1 1 according the outputs are obtained in grey code ok in the first transition the input is 0 and output is 0 and in another transition input is 1 and output is 1 the next transition input is 2 and output is 3 in the next transition input is 3 the output is 2 and so on these are the grey code values hence this is the binary to grey converter in behavioral model and the next one is data flow type here in the data flow the equations are used I have written the equations by using XR gates for each output ok then next step is implementation save the code and click on implementation and click on binary to gray and double click on synthesize xst and check syntax view rtl schematic and view technology schematic and design summary reports here LUT is 3 IO buffers 8 and time for completion of synthesis is 6 seconds and close design summary technology schematic and RTN schematic and coming to simulation part we are using the same test bench here ok click on simulation click on binary to gray underscore tb and simulate behavioral model the outputs are obtained same as in behavioral model now coming to another part that is gate level modeling ok here is the gate level modeling code buffer and XR gates are used 
in the gate level modeling okay in the next part save the code and click on implementation and click on binary to gray and synthesize xst check syntax view rtl schematic and technology schematic these are LUTs and output buffers and input buffers and design summary reports synthesis report LUT is 3 IO buffer C8 and completion time is 7 seconds close report technology schematic and RDL schematic coming to simulation part click on simulation click on binary to gray and double click on simulate behavioral model Since we have got the outputs same as in behavioral model. So this concludes the binary to gray converter. You need to write the code for gray to binary and binary to XS3. Okay, thank you.